In the Naval is the second segment of the 12th episode of the fourth season of Rugrats, and this is a pretty good episode. Though I do have one question. If, if Angelica has water sports, Cynthia, why does she still have really scraggly hair? I'm a bit confused as to whether it's classic Cynthia or water sports Cynthia, so that threw me for a bit. But once I got over that, it's an enjoyable episode. This actually takes place on a boat, uh, Grandpa Lou... Stu and Drew are fishing and we have the classic rivalry between the brothers about who's going to collect the best fish. Um, collect isn't the right word there. And obviously Grandpa Lou has some stories to tell about his younger days as well. And meanwhile, the babies, uh, Tommy and Chucky, are trying to be wavy seals, as they call it, and they want to rescue something. And Angelica is trying to play with her water sports Cynthia or classic Cynthia, and her new Cynthia boat. But unfortunately, something happens to Cynthia in the water, and the babies try and rescue Cynthia, but kind of potentially make things a bit worse. And, well, actually, not much else happens. The whole mystery is surrounding what will happen to Cynthia, and, of course, who will get the biggest fish. And I rather enjoyed it. I think it's a nice change of pace for a different environment. It's not that we never have these characters together, but I always like it when we have, you know, Grandpa Lou and his sons interacting with each other. It's a really nice family setup and works really well. And, and I had good fun with it. It's definitely an episode that's pretty predictable in parts, but not in others. So I think the narrative developed very well, very well written, definitely well animated. Really nice location. The water looks great. The design of the boat is really good. Definitely an episode that I think works really well for the environment and the characters. I've just realised that Angelica was told to stay somewhere by her father and then she just walked off and that's not exactly great. But what else can we expect from Angelica? I don't think there was anything in this that I wanted to quote. Sometimes I like certain quotes in Rugrats, not so much the case here. But of course we have the wavy seals, which I rather liked. Um, definitely a good episode. Never would be one that would be my all-time favourite, but despite that it's really good start to finish flaws well nice narrative structure nice animation really no complaints about in the navel at all